we at this Manhattanville, it's like a community market, but Manhattanville market. So they got a couple different restaurants, this community thing. I'm trying out this buttermilk biscuit chicken sandwich. Gonna try that out today. The savory churros, jalapeno churros, but uh, mostly garlic jalapeno butter. What? They're doing much larger for the restaurant. It's a little okay. Snack. Cool. Thank you. All right. So we just got a. These are jalapeno churros with a sauce on the side. Look at that right there. Look at that right there. That's that looks good. So it's going to have a little sweetness with the hot. So that's the sweet churro right there. That's at the Mexican spot. So as I was saying, you got a couple of different restaurants and then you got the Mexican spot over there with the tacos and everything. So I wanted to bring y'all around for this side for the unboxing. Hey, hey. This is the new kind of unboxing. You got your fries right here. Go fries. All right, look at that. Look at that right there. That's a biscuit. It's a biscuit. Some sauce in there. That's a big biscuit too. So look at that biscuit right there. Look at that jaw. Look at that. Then I give you a shot of these right here. See them right there? They're right there. Children's. Alright. I'm ready to rub. Rub a dub. Thanks for the grub. Let's get it on. Alright. So we're going with the sandwich here. Mm. Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, good. She's good. I don't know. Good. It's nice and soft and subtle. I would literally say that it's shaking hands with my taste buds. Like, it's a very nice, how you doing? Not a lot of spice in it. But it's got good flavor and texture. I like the texture. Yeah, definitely good looking out whoever posted this. Because I even asked one of the chefs, Mike, I said, what do you suggest? Can you give me a couple of things? I was getting ready to get the swarmer. Where is that everybody with these biscuits, the, the chicken and the biscuit joint? And I was like, all right. Well, let's go with the header and see if it's really hitting. I even have some complimentary water over there. Some nice ice, ice cold water. Hot day like today. I picked up the Celsius from Times Square. After I did the yoga. I'm gonna try the Celsius. This is the uh, sparkling prickly pear lime edition. Oh, goodness. Whoa. That's good. That's good right there. I'm with this. I like the way this place is set up too. It's a nice little ambiance. There's plenty of places to charge and everything. So you got your laptop, whatever. You can plug in. All right. I guess I'm gonna take the little school right here. Take a look at that right there. Little crab. And it's the churro right here. See that churro? I'm gonna put a little bit on the churro. Oh my god. Whoa. That John. Alright. When you look at it, and he said churro, I was thinking like a churro, like it was gonna be hard when you buy, when you go into it. This joint is like puffy. It's like a puff pastry almost, but it's not, it's not super sweet. And it doesn't hit you right away with the jalapeno. Like the jalapeno is real nice and subtle. So you, it's like puffy. And then you get a, the taste of the jalapeno and the sauce. So this, yeah, I could see snack. I could see getting this, this right here. This right here is nice. I don't know how big the, the regular portion is, but this is a good, good hit right here. Mmm, oh. Yeah, cause it's nice and soft. It's nice and airy. 
Let's go. Everybody need to make their churros like that. You know? You don't gotta fight with the churro to eat it. So if I were, I'm gonna say like, if you knew Broadway, where we at, 120, 25th, 24th, something like that, put the information up on the screen somewhere. Or if you in the area, this place is not part of the college. It is separate. There's like a, 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 a fitness place. They say yoga, climbing, fitness. And I thought it was like yoga climbing. I was like, how are you gonna do yoga and climb at the same time? But no, they're separate. So it's right near that place. And it's right underneath the train, not too far from the station. Nice, good place to chill out. And we're about a, I would say about a block away, half a block. There's a nice little park area. You can sit outside, meet. It's right near the water. So it's a nice chill spot. Or you can come here, get some, then go over to the park or whatever you're going to do. But they got plenty of tables. Seating's nice. So yeah, that is Manhattanville Market. Check them out. Do me a favor, hit that like button and subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Really do appreciate it and it helps out the channel a lot. And until next adventure, remember, take care of each other, peace out, and I will see you all soon.